everyone, welcome back to my channel. Brenda Summers here, Independent Sensei Consultant. Welcome if you're new and welcome back if you're not. I was asked to share my um, fall winter stash with you. This is my own personal collection. This is what I'm going to be concentrating on this season. Um, hopefully I'll get through the fall winter time and have, I'm hoping half of this stuff melted. We will see. This to me is a huge collection, but to some, this is nothing. I do own other retailer um, wax or retail wax and vendor wax, but I concentrate on Scentsy a lot during the winter and fall time frame. So I won't be going over scent notes, but I will be sharing with you what I'm trying to get through for the fall winter. This is what I consider fall winter scents. Some people may beg to differ but to me this is what I think of when I think of fall winter time frame so anyways I will have other wax that I will concentrate on as well I shared the harvest collection with you in a previous Sensi video so I will be concentrating on that wax as well um, I just can't find it or I would have put it in with this um, collection video but anyways this is my own personal Scentsy Wax collection for the fall winter. So anyways, without further ado, let's deep dive into it. Some of it you can still get um, in this fall winter catalog and some of it is either retired or past scents that you cannot get. So anyways, um, I can't go over all the scent notes. It'll just take forever. I think this will take forever to get through my collection. But anyways, Without further ado, let's deep dive into it. So, one of my favorites for this time of year, and I think of it being a fall, Halloween kind of scent, is Caramel Vanilla Delight. I'm really, really upset that Scentsy took this away. This was from a Bring Back My Bar. Um, I fell in love with this after the fact, after they took it out of the catalog, so I ended up getting a bar from Bring Back My Bar. I really, really like it. At first I didn't, to me it was like too light, but it's very, very nice for the fall. It's got the caramel, it's got the vanilla. It's really, really nice. So caramel, vanilla delight. Another one that I consider to be a fall scent is Sticky Cinnamon Bun. This is from the O Canada collection. I gotta get through this. This was from 2019. This is when, um, Canada was with Scentsy for 10 years and they brought out the old Canada collection. So sticky cinnamon bun. It's light, but I really, really love it. And it goes great for the fall winter time frame. It's a bakery. Um, I also consider Caramel Vanilla Delight to be a bakery. So a very nice bakery. As well as Pumpkin Tiramisu. Out of that whole collection, everybody liked Bright Cider Life. I loved Pumpkin Tiramisu. To me, that was the epitome of a nice fall um, bakery. It had the right amount of pumpkin and spices and cinnamon. And I really, really love this. And of course, I didn't buy enough. So I think this is my only bar. So I'm going to enjoy it while I have it. Another one that I really, really like. Oh, I guess I have two bars of this. Yay, it's Caramel Vanilla Delight. So I have two bars of this I didn't realize. So, yummy, yummy, yummy. Another one that I received from my friend, um, Karen Wells. She's an independent sensory consultant in Australia. She sent this to me over a year ago um, as a thank you because I had sent her a bunch of wax and she sent me a beautiful mini warmer as well. This is Coconut Flan. I haven't got around to warming this but to me this is um, the epitome of um, fall bakery I guess you could have melted it in the summer or spring but I'm gonna melt it this fall I got to do it um, because I want to experience the coconut flan so I love coconut I love bakery and of course in Australia and overseas they have these um, like silver Oil lining to it and then there's the wax and she already has the set notes it's whipped butter cocoa powder and coconut cream and that's what I think of 
as being fall. So I will enjoy that. That's coconut flan. And then last but not least, and you can get it in the winter fall catalog or fall winter catalog right now. It's caramel apple craze. To me, this is the epitome of fall. It reminds me of a good caramel apple that you would get from a fall fair or for around Halloween time when sometimes you used to get caramel apples. I like to do caramel apples. So this is so good. So if you get a chance to get it, please do because it's a good one and especially around the fall time frame. So that's one of my favorites to melt. So I'm just gathering up everything. Okay, another one that I, I don't really care for it, but I, I gotta get through it is Scarlet Sunflower. Not sure if you can get it in this catalog, but anyways, I consider this to be like a fall, August, fall, transition kind of scent winter and this is okay it's a floral um, I like it better since it's sat a little bit more but it's not one of my favorite florals but I've got to get through it so I consider this to be fall scarlet sunflower another one in my collection is baked apple pie this is the epitome of fall when you get into picking your own apples or going to market and getting fresh apples like a good fresh pumpkin pie with flaky pastry and crust this is just basic but it's really really good i would recommend you picking up at least a bar and it's got that nice sweet cinnamon the apple the flaky crust oh this is so 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 good um, you can mix it with other scents like vanilla scent like a creamy kind of scent or just do it on its own like I do very very nice to me that's the epitome of fall so baked apple pie another one I don't know if I consider this to be fall you could warm it all year round it's birthday wishes it's kind of like birthday um, happy birthday but toned down um, happy birthday to me is like a marble kind of cake this is just birthday cake straight up um, white batter birthday cake with some frosting on it very very nice I consider this to be a fall scent you can also warm it all year round Hap or this is birthday wishes so if you have happy birthday that's another good one too another one is simply vanilla this you can mix you can leave it on its own if you like vanilla scents this is a good basic vanilla scent um, this was from bring back my bar you used to be able to get it in the catalog but now they since retired it so i have one bar of this so i'm going to really enjoy it while i have it and then a lot of people don't like this because i think it has roses or something in it that isn't anybody's cup of tea but i like lemon drizzle cake to me this came out in the easter um, collection a couple years back they have it in the catalog now this is a really good lemon cake to me it's bakery it's good for the fall it's good for you all year round but i'm gonna warm it um this fall so to me that's a good fall scent so that's just me though somebody may put that in a different category but it's bakery so anything bakery you can do in the fall winter time frame next one in my collection is brownie batter ah oh, they took this away i love this this is the epitome of gooey chocolatey fudgy brownies very very good scent i love it you can mix it with a mint scent or any kind of vanilla scent you can mix it with about anything but this is so decadent. I really, really love it. I only have one bar, though. But anyways, I'm going to enjoy it. To me, that's the epitome of fall. When you get into the bakery, I love chocolate, bakery, desserts. Uh, I just, I love dessert. Oh. <laughs> so anyways, brownie batter is a good one. Vanilla bourbon. Oh, I love this. This was part of a Father's Day collection, I believe. To me, it's not boozy. It's very, very nice. The vanilla comes out. The bourbon comes out. But very, very nice. To me, it's a nice light to medium kind of scent. 
very, very good for the fall. So I'm going to enjoy that when I get around to it. Pumpkin cinnamon swirl. You can get it in the catalog. This is a great one. It took me a while to come around to it, but I really, really love it. It's kind of like a sticky cinnamon bun meets pumpkin. This is sweet cinnamon. It's got all the spices plus the pumpkin. It's sweet. It's, it's really, really good. So it's like a pumpkin sticky bun to me. So that's in the fall catalog right now. Pick it up. At least try it once. It's really, really good. Clementine Cupcake to me is a fall scent. It's an anytime scent, but to me, I'm going to be doing it this fall. It's because it's bakery. It's got that Clementine. It's got that cupcake. It's got the white batter. Oh, and then the Clementine. So, so good. Sweet, but not overly sweet. Not flowing. And then I still have yet to do the Sunspirations. I think this was part of the collection from last year. Caramel buttercream, um, buttercream, um, what was it, frosting? Ugh. What's the one that, anyways, tell me down below what I'm trying to say. What was the base to this? It was the buttercream scent, right? And then they added caramel. So anyways, this is really nice. To me, they were um, passing it off as a holiday scent. To me, it's a fall winter scent. So I look forward to actually melting that. It's actually stronger this year than it was last year. It was very, very light to me. So that's why I didn't really melt it last year. Another one that I'm really going to enjoy, and it's probably going to be a mixer because it's really strong. It's Peppermint Rush. Peppermint Rush is really good. It was from Bring Back My Bar. It's not as pepperminty or it is a wham bam in your face kind of scent. So it's a good mixer. Um, perfectly peppermint is um, really strong. And I think that's in this year's catalog. I'm really not up on my catalog, am I? <laughs> I suck, I guess. But anyways, I know what I know. So anyways... This was a good one, so I consider it to be a fall winter scent. Another one is Peppermint Dreams. I have so many of these. It's just like a cool junior mint. Um, very, very nice. Peppermint Patty. This was from Bring Back My Bar. They've had it in the clearance a few times. So if you ever get a chance to pick it up, please do. This is one of my favorites. So I have a lot of those. And then Peppermint Dreams from the O Canada. So that tells you how long I've had some of these bars. So I got to get going. And then another Peppermint Dreams. So I got to get going on these. And another Peppermint Dreams. So I've got two, four of those, plus a Peppermint Rush. Okay. Cinnamon Buttercream. Oh. Love that one. They took away apple apple buttercream, I think. Oh, I love that one. This is really, really nice. It's a buttercream. It's got cinnamon in it. You can make your own cinnamon buttercream. Um, but this is nice. So to me, this is a fall scent. It's also a good mixer. Um, vanilla bourbon again. Another one. Um, Appleberry. I got to get through this. This was from Karen, Karen Wells. She's an Australian Sensi consultant. She lives in Australia. She's my friend. She sent it up to me. I don't think I ever had this before, but to me, this is like a bakery. So I'm going to, it's very fragrant. It's got crimson cranberry and pomegranate in it. To me, it's a fall scent. I'm considering it to be a fall scent. Apple Press is another fall scent. I got this on Bring Back My Bar. I've melted this in the past. It has like a floral to it. It's not overly floral. It's a very, very nice apple scent for the fall. And Pai Oh Mai is also from Karen Wells. Um, she's an Australian Sensi consultant, like I said, and she's my friend, and she sent this to me. So Pai Oh Mai, 
And oh my, the cinnamon in it. It's red apple cinnamon spice flaky pastry pie crust. So I look forward to actually um, melting this. This is up there with baked apple pie. So um, thank you again for sending me these um, scents, um, Karen. I really, really appreciate that. I have to get through them. Peppermint brush. Okay. Next one is pumpkin roll. I don't like it as much as pumpkin cinnamon swirl because it doesn't have the cinnamon. It's just the straight pumpkin and the roll. It's like um, white batter with pumpkin in it. It's good though. And they also have it in a brook. So if you're really, really craving pumpkin and a roll, you could probably put a cinnamon scent to it to make it like a pumpkin cinnamon swirl. So they do have it in the brick in this year's catalog. So they came out with three bricks. Um, Mighty Spruce or Spruce. Oh, I'm really bad. Um, Christmas Cottage and Pumpkin Roll. So <laughs> tell me what the other brick was. Um, it's the Spruce one, Spruce Tree. Yeah, <laughs> really bad. Um, so Pumpkin Roll, I consider to be a fall scent. Another one that I consider is a caramel apple craze. I already went over that. I have more than what I thought. Cutie Pie Cupcake, consider to be a um, fall scent. Can melt it any year, any time of the year. It's just really, it's just orange cupcake. Yummy, yummy, yummy. It's a bakery. Um, vanilla Bourbon, again. So I have more than what I thought I did. And then Hug in a Mug is another one that they took away. Why, Sensi? These brownie batter, mocha doodle, and Hug in a Mug should be fall scents. They should be staples. Why are you taking away? It's like hazelnut frosting, um, chocolate. Ugh, this is so good too. It just reminds me of a decadent hot chocolate. You can add a vanilla scent, a buttercream scent to sweeten it up. To me, this is a fall scent and they take it away. Why? And then apple, Johnny Appleseed, of course. That's a staple. I think I have a brick somewhere. Maybe I have to buy another brick. I think I gave a brick away. But this is the epitome of fall. Oh, just straight up apple and crisp pear. Juicy Macintosh apple and crisp pear, I think it is. So very, very nice. I have it in cleaning I have it in the counter clean. I have it in the all-purpose spray. I love it in the cleaning um, scent. So I got to get more. Gingerbread buttercream. I should have bought two of these collections. I don't know why. This is just straight up gingerbread with the buttercream. Oh, very, very nice. I love gingerbread um, scents. I missed out on the clearance with gingerbread donut. They had it. I went to buy it and... They were sold out, like ticked me off. That was just a few weeks ago too. Mulberry bush is another fall scent I consider fall. I don't know why, but I do. Um, it's sweet, it's decadent. You could also warm it in the spring summer time frame, but to me, it's gonna be fall this year. Huckleberry sage, you really gotta like the huckleberries, and I really, really do. I don't get the sage from this one. I get the nice huckleberry kind of smell. To me, this is fall. Could probably warm it all year round, but to me, it reminds me of a fall scent. Next one is sticky cinnamon bun again. Another peppermint dreams. Um, one bite from the villains. Just one bite from the villains collection. This is an apple kind of spice kind of scent this is available right now so get it while you can it's a good one um it's a good apple scent oh this i've had it for a while and it actually smells a lot better than what it was i didn't like it when i first bought it so i just didn't melt it i threw it in the corner so i'm gonna warm it maybe i'll pick up a few more of these this is really really good and i consider that to be a fall scent and Another one is salted caramel toffee. I really don't care for this, but I got to get through it. <sighs> to me, I don't know. It doesn't smell like what it's supposed to, but I got to get through it. Appealing apple is another apple scent. I 
believe you can get it in this catalog. Don't quote me. This is another good apple scent. Oh, love it, love it, love it. So me and my apple scents bring on the apple. So, um, yay. Okay, we're getting there. We're halfway through. <laughs> so bear with me. Um, lemon thyme berry. Really, really love it. I've had this for a while. It's from Bring Back My Bar. Um, you get the lemon, you get the berry. I don't necessarily get the thyme from it, but I really, really, really love it. You could probably do this as a spring summer, but I'm going to do it as a fall scent. Huckleberry hideaway. You got to like huckleberries. This is a little bit different. Um, you're getting more of the deeper huckleberry. But this is a good one if you ever get a chance, please do. Most of the huckleberry ones I really, really enjoy. So um, if you ever get a chance to do a huckleberry scent, please do. This is another one from my friend Karen Wells. She's an independent scentsy consultant in Australia. I'll link her um, channel down below. She had sent this one. It's mixed berry papalova. It's a bakery. And, of course, she... Mixed berries, pavlova, sweet meringue. Oh, this has got to be so, so good. So this was from Bring Back Their Bar. So I look forward to actually melting that. I'm really bad at not melting wax. Um, pretty and plum. Oh, this, I love it better than sweet plum pastry. This, to me, has a deeper plum. Um, it's a nicer, I consider it bakery in fall just sweet plum pastry just has a weirdness about it that I didn't like so I'm going to enjoy that and my home yeah um, kind of reminds me of welcome home but uh, I don't know what it is about this I really don't like it as well to me this is more fresh than what welcome home is welcome home has more of um your fall kind of scents, from what I can recall, it has more cinnamon scent. This, ugh, I don't know, mocha doodle. So mocha doodle, I think you can get in this catalog this time around. Don't quote me though. It's another good one. It goes with brownie batter, a hug and a mug. Like why wouldn't they just bring these back? Like we don't have enough chocolate or coffee scents and they have to get rid of them. This to me, screens fall only because of the chocolate aspect component of it it's deep it's rich it's got the coffee it's really really good another pretty and plum love it well black cherry was from bring back my bar not necessarily a fall scent but i'm gonna consider it to be a fall scent it's reminds me of a popsicle it reminds me of um, cherry soda so I'm considering it to be fall <laughs> black berry orange marmalade from was from bring back my bar this is really nice the orange comes out the blackberry and it's a very good and sweet to me I consider that to be a bakery that's why I'm considering it to be fall this also came from my friend Karen Wells She's an independent Sunsi consultant in Australia, citrus pear cider. So it's a fall scent to me because of the pear, because of the cider in it. And of course, the notes are gone, but I can't. I'm looking forward to actually melting these. So um, thank you very much again, Karen, for sending these to me. I apologize that I haven't melted them. By now you would have thought but anyways that's just me i forget that i have wax and yeah <laughs> another one is you could lift a wreath sorry my throat is getting dry because i've been talking non-stop this is a nice fresh scent it's good for um, november december time frame i really really love it to me it's like a christmas tree it, if you don't have a favorite Christmas tree scent, then do this one, Eucalyptus Wreath, because it's a good alternative. And it's not overly eucalyptus -y. it's not overly fresh, but it's different. It's really 
different to anything out there. Arctic Kiss you can get, I believe, in this fall winter catalog. This is another nice, crisp, cool, um, fresh kind of scent for the winter. I really love this one, so I consider it to be a winter kind of scent. You can do it in the fall. Summer rain, okay. It's not really a fall scent, but you can get summer rain anytime. <laughs> You can get rain at any point in time. You get fall rain. So anyways, this is really nice. This is the little sister to Thunderstorm, if you like Thunderstorm. I'm melting this in the fall, even though you could do it in the summer, spring time frame. And then you got Thunderstorm. Thunderstorm is a nice um, floral, deep, darker. Um, like I said, this is the big brother. This is the little sister. You can melt this any time of the year. I'm going to melt it in the fall only because I didn't melt it this past summer or spring. I even forgot that I had them. Another one is Icicles and Evergreen. I don't know if it's... No, I, they took it away. This is a good one. This um, is not as sweet as Ice Pine, but it's sweet. It's got your evergreen. Very, very nice, fresh kind of tree kind of scent. So really, really love it. Disney's Season of Magic is coming back. So this is a nice tree scent. So grab it when it comes back. It's coming out in the holiday collection, I think, with the sleigh with Minnie and Mickey. So that's coming up October 1st, I think. Um, I'm not really sure when it's coming out but it's coming out for the holiday season so I know this is coming back so grab it while you can if it's not already here I don't know I'm not up on everything by the sea I melt this all year round this is my go-to scent when I'm really down having a bad day need a pick me up it's dewy green grass ocean breeze that type of thing fresh but I really like it and I will melt it in the fall. <laughs> like I said, I melt it any time of the year. Um, tinselberry is another good one. Why did you take it away? This was such a good winter, fall kind of scent. Not sure what's in it, but it's really sweet and really nice to me. It's the epitome of holiday time frame, winter time frame, that type of thing. Mighty Pine is another good one. Um, it's not as sweet as Ice Pine. Take away the iced um, sweetness from Ice Pine and you've got Mighty Pine. So it's a little bit stronger, a little bit more woodsy. And then, of course, you have Ice Pine. This they took away on me. This is, I don't know if this is my last bar, but this was my tree scent up until they took it away. So I'm trying to find a good tree scent now, which is really ticking me off. But anyways, what can you do? That's scentsy, you never know. Um, another cutie pie cupcake. Jack Obsession, oh, love it, love it, love it. This is a nice apple, cinnamon kind of scent. Oh, I don't have enough of him. I only have one, two, three, four bars left. I should have picked up more. I thought they would have brought him out again, but of course they didn't. They might bring him back later on in another year, but I will enjoy it while I have it. Light Amber Antique kind of surprised me. I like it a lot. It's kind of perfumey. It's kind of laundry. It's kind of everything that I didn't think it would be. It's nice. So if you get a chance to try it, try it. Vanilla Blackberry. I like this one. Since vanilla is blackberry, if you like deep blackberry scents, you'll love that one. Ursula, Poor Souls from the Villains is coming back. If it's not already back, pick her up because they're there for a limited time only. I really love her. This is a really, really good villain's scent. So I've got to go in and buy some more. 
I think that's my last bar. Another icicles and evergreen. And what else? The Haunted Mansion, three thumbs up. This reminds me of bakery. A lot of people say it's like bread. I don't get bread from this. So I get like a sweet um, bakery note from it. So that's just me. I really, really love it. And then this time around, they don't have Mistress of Evil. They brought back um, Deep Dark and Devious or whatever villain wax i would have preferred they brought but the back this one dark and devious i think it is sorry uh, i really like this one this was my favorite from that three bar collection so if she ever comes back i gotta get i'm stuttering now i gotta get more of her because i think of this one as being a false scent as well like i said i have two of the three villains warmers um I don't know if I said that or not. I'm kind of debating about the the most recent villains um, warmer. It's the poison apple. Um, Sixty six dollars though. Um, sorry, I'm at tea. Um, I'm still on the fence. I probably won't get it. I probably by the time I decide to get it, it'll be sold out. Um, who knows? I might get it. I might not. Southern evening is kind of like. Um, thunderstorm and some marine put together um it's like a gentleman or i don't know what you would call it it's just different and i consider it to be fall another ice pine so i've got two ice pines that's it and then i have the harry potter collection cunning and amb ambition slytherin i did not like this collection so it's kind of in my fall collection it kind of not blue christmas is another great one it's another nice beautiful i think it's blue spruce and something else and something else another arctic kiss almost there almost there i got another arctic kiss newborn nursery you can do any time of the year it's baby powder gotta love baby powder scents fuzzy blanket this is my one and only I love it. Um, it's got lavender and something else. That's great for this time of year. Blue Christmas, another one. Another icicles and evergreen. And what else? Icicles and evergreen. Ice pine. Yay! Another ice pine. Last but not least, wild for fall. So at least I like icicles and evergreen. They took it away too, like the Ice Pine. But Wild for Fall is another good one. It was part of the Harvard Collection, I think, last year. But anyways, this is what I'm considering to be fall scents. I know I will be melting other scents other than these, but this is my primary um, fall, winter collection. I probably have others somewheres in another bin. I just have so much whack. So thank you very much for sharing sharing this haul with me or taking the time out to listen to what bars I have in my haul. Um, if you're interested in um, any of these, I can get you the scent notes. It's, most of them you can't buy anymore. But anyways, if you need help, I'm always here. Um, what more can I say? Um, Please like and subscribe and hit that notification bell for all things uploaded by me. You just never know, surprise, what I'm going to be uploading. Um, I've got more Scentsy videos coming in the f near future, so look out for those. Um, I was really excited to be sharing this with you. I even forgot some of the scents that I had, to be honest. Um, this is quite a collection for me. I don't think I'm going to get through it even through the two seasons. Like if I get through a bar a week, <laughs> I'm lucky nowadays. But anyways, I've been trying to melt more. Um, anyways, tell me what scents you love. Tell me what scents maybe I didn't have in my collection that you have. And you absolutely have to have it in your um, collection if you have a Scentsy Club, I got rid of my Scentsy Club a long time ago. Drove me nuts. I just, uh, yeah. <laughs>
anyways, I hope you're having a great day. It's a great day here in southwestern Ontario, Canada. I hope you enjoy the rest of your week. Take care. Catch on the flip side. Bye for now.